Hey fellow YouTubers, uh, this is Emerald Beast here, now known as Emerald Legend on PS4. I'm here to talk about PS4 updates. So, as pretty much everybody knows by now, as of December 19th, I believe, version software update version 7.02 has come out. And if you're like me, where you woke up, turned on your PS4 to go watch some TV, and it doesn't turn on, you restart it, and you notice that you can't do a software update 7.02, you'll be pissed. I went and did a whole research thing over it, it took me about 20 minutes to find it, and it gave me an error code, CE3... One three four one or something like that. Three four three six one or something like that. Essentially, that just mean that gives you the error. That error code gives you the reason of your hard drive being damaged in some sort of way, and tells you to go get basically go get a fucking new hard drive and copy over your files. Don't do that. I have found an easier way to do that. Literally, all you have to do, restart your PS4 completely, and go to your settings, and go all the way down to system software update, and do it straight from there. That's all you have to do. No need for all that other BS. Okay, guys. I did this video just so I can save you guys some time to where you don't have to do things I did. And it does work. I cannot turn my screen around, but let me see if I can point this to y'all. I don't know if y'all can see it, but it does say system software version 7.02 update file installed. So it does work. Just letting y'all know. Don't go buy a new hard drive or anything like that. If it's like mine, your PlayStation won't start up at f completely at first. It will just go to a black screen. Unplug your power cord. Restart it. Let it do that system check thing. That whatever the hell that does. And it will probably tell you something's corrupted. Connect your PS4 controller to USB uh, cord. And connect it directly to the PS4 itself. Press the power button. And it will give you an option. Tell you that your system's uh, internal hard drive is messed up. It's not... Just restart it again, and it'll go straight to the home screen, or at least it should, unless yours really is messed up, then you got some problems. And then go to your settings, system software update, do it through there, and you'll have no more problems with that. Alright guys, Emerald Beast signing off, see you guys next time.